Okay, here's the AP. I'm gonna do the some wiring connection, the correct connection for the major component of the AP. I'm not gonna connect to the uh, receiver and the servo thing. There's very clear mark on the AP which one from the picture here to your left is go in that means from your receiver and see on the bottom on the right the arrow go to the right that means is for the server that's gonna output to your airplane all right I got the GPS here you by looking at the wiring and I'm sure there's a a text underneath of that the hitch string I hope you can see it VCC ground TXD RXD from the wiring output pole you can see red is the VCC black is the ground TXD is from the GPS to the AP that is yellow and the white same here as the current sensor you can see there is a ground ground GND and also on the other side of the current sensor one is from the battery see I had a DIN connector on my battery for my battery and this output you're gonna sort sort a connector DIN connector whatever you use or the wire to it and on the bottom is the ground you see it's all the way connected we suggest you put you team a little bit solder over the PCB trace here to in increase the current flow for the current sensor it it reduce the resistance and increase the current all right here ground see it ground from here is the ground on the bottom and the red one is the 5 volt the yellow and the white I believe yellow is the voltage sensing white is the current sensing same from the other end of the current sensor as you see oh, I have back cable here and you can see here black 5 volt yellow white so the same as the GPS too we had the same pattern keep everything the same almost and here is my 5.8 a transmitter and this is from the transmitter and you can see here is black the blue one actually is 12 volt be careful about that yellow is the radio white is the uh, audio and one thing is the this power cable for the AP it should come with the AP from your your box that I ship it to you or someone ship it to you okay from here there's marking here let me on the on this side you can see the plus minus side cam aux AV transmitter sensor EST that means it's the top if we view in the GPS from another uh, AP from this side that means it we have five pin a row here that means is the blue is the blue we color coded it's blue pin and on the bottom there's is for the servo output and some of them are for the GPS too so let's go ahead and connect the the AP with the power cable first red one facing up that means travel power 
and go into the the left corner the left corner top left corner the, the blue pin when you finish it should look like this see it see it clear clear like that all right now I'm gonna connect the transmitter because it's on the bottom of the on the second blue pin so uh, yes and the uh, black wire facing to the left when you put the AP upside down you're gonna notice that when I put it in after I put it in you're gonna notice that how it looks like see black 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 to the black to the cable here here the AP actually is upside down yeah and yes yeah. oh yeah now I'm gonna get a camera that's the camera that I'm using see here black black and red and white white is the way there black is ground red one is travel that is going to be on the top blue pin see and next to the next to the power pin just like that when you finish connection see ground facing left for this one all right uh, now I'm gonna connect the most most troublemaker the current sensor current sensor current sensor black is facing white this time it's facing to the GPS the GPS the GPS side the black one so on the second rail blue pin you count from right to the left two pins it should go beside the, the VTX and leave one pin you can see I have one pin spacing between the VTX and the current sensor don't make it wrong this is most common one and the empty pin over there is for the RSSI okay that is it if you put it up look like that you gonna you're gonna have no trouble at all now I'm gonna connect the GPS for the GPS the black one is facing to the bottom of the AP and it's the last one last pull and we leave one pin on top empty you can see here is four pin on AP we have five pin per row so no per column I'm sorry and you can see we only use the bottom four pins so plug it in I'm gonna show you how it looks like that is how it looks like see it there's one pin when you plug in the GPS there's one pin spacing between the GPS and the current sensor and also there's one pin between the current sensor between the current sensor and the radio transmitter see it? camera on top of the transmitter on top of the radio transmitter yeah that's about it I hope you guys can get a very clear look on my connection